project that will cost hundreds of thousands of dollars. Bayutesh beer is sold in several states and internationally. As our Valerie Ponsetti reports, this expansion will help keep those beers on tap. We started in that little rail car over there. And then a few months after we started, uh, I just took off here and in New Orleans and Baton Rouge and we had to build this building here. We've been in here about three and a half years. And now it's time to upgrade again. The Louisiana market is expanding, so we're having to make more and more just for Acadiana and for New Orleans and Baton Rouge and North Louisiana. And then we're in Texas now, and that's another big state. We're in uh, six other states and in Quebec. The brewery is making room for more equipment, more beer, and maybe more on the menu. Right now we have 19 beers we do every year, which is a lot for a brewery our size. And uh, we have some more tanks coming in, more fermenting tanks. Those take up a lot of room. So it's just that we're just uh, slam-packed with room in this building, which was just three years ago way too big for us. Bayutesh will be expanding in space to keep up with demand, but as far as more locations, owners say not just yet. We have a kind of a joke here. We won't go anywhere. They don't serve grits and sweet tea. And so that's pretty much our own low states now. Um, and, and we're happy. Uh, we're, making, we're all you know, making a living, and we're all uh, doing what we love. In Arneville, Valerie Ponsetti, KTC. TV3. Hey, while we're on the